All right, all right, ladies and gents. Maze, welcome to this very channel. Hey, welcome to this channel. It's another time, it's another time we meet. By the way, this is a very new channel that will be bringing you everything to do with Chelsea. It's all about Chelsea. It's all about the blues. And I'm so glad to meet you here. Before now, we go into all details. Please go to... Um, that channel subscribe and make sure you are in touch so that we can be you know learning from every happening around stanford bridge now before i start we all know that uh, this is there's a new season coming that is 2022 2023 who is excited of course uh i'm excited and i know you are excited because um Every time Premier League is around the corner or when Premier League is ongoing, the world is happy. And so I am. So before I start, let's first appreciate our very own coach, Thomas Tuchel, for everything that he has done for us as the Blues. All right. Let's appreciate him. Um, and I felt it's good and it will be of impact if I start with his picture, you know with what he has achieved for us uh, kila kitu ambayo ame achieve kama coach wa Chelsea and everyone is happy because of what uh, this guy has been able to bring uh, the table signings trophies you know everything super cup world cup champions league uh, not from last season but from the time he took office he has been brilliant tactically socially and everything Second, let me also appreciate some players, you know, some of those big names that has been, you know, making our world in blue uh, the best. Mm? The big names, the Drogba's, uh, the John Terry's of this world, the Frank Lampard of this world, uh, Mason Mount, he has also been great and brilliant. Now, let's get into it. We all know that the EPL fixture for 2022-2023 is out. And I've, I've been looking at, you know, our matches as Chelsea and I'm like, whoa, we have a task ahead and we have a lot to do. So let's start uh, by looking at this fixture. Look at this. This is our complete fixture for 2022-2023. We'll be away. We'll start away at Everton, a team that beat us in our last match, 2021-2022. 2022 season they beat us one nil and remember this is not a walk in the park this is what this is not a walkover everton has been so hard on us every time and if you look at our last uh our last head to head or rather our our head to head um the last time we played it wasn't that good. And, and and now Everton is in the hands of our former player. That is Frank Lampard. So you understand the rivalry um, the, the, between us. So it won't be easy. It won't be easy. So this fixture is, of course, uh, the one that will be used this season 2021. To, I mean 2022-2023. In the month of August, we have Everton away. We have, uh, that is on 6th of August. On 13th of August, we have Tottenham. That is a derby, a big derby in the hands of uh, our also, also our former coach. Uh, we also have Leeds United on the 20th of August. We have Leicester City on 27th and 31st uh, Southampton. So we have six matches in one month. And then again, in September, we also have West Ham United, Fulham, Liverpool. That is on 3rd, 10th and 17th uh, respectively um in the month of october we have six matches also two in the month of november uh two in december january we have we'll start off with manchester city crystal palace liverpool that is a very very big and tough match i mean tough month all right we also have february uh, with four matches uh, including tottenham Hotspur return uh, return match we have fulham which has uh, been promoted 
uh, West Ham and Southampton. Southampton, that is, I beg your pardon, Manchester. I mean, in the, in the month of March, we have Leeds, we have Leicester, we have Everton. And then April, that is the next year, 2023, we have six matches, including the return leg um, against Manchester United and also the Arsenal in that same month. Mm -hmm. um, and the month of May, we will, of course, have four matches uh, with Man City, Newcastle, uh, FC Bonamount, the Nottingham Forest. Uh, we'll finish off. Uh, we, we will actually lift this trophy at newcastle Ooh, ooh! <laughs> this is our season this is our season by the way so from there i hope you've uh, at least briefly seen what we are up against let's now focus on the derbies <laughs> our derbies saturday 5th november we have arsenal that will be on saturday uh november 2022 and then return leg will be on saturday 29th of april next year 2023 another derby on tuesday october 2022 we have brentford and the return leg 26th april 2023 the other derby we have saturday 1st of october 2022 and the return leg saturday 14th january 2023 goodness goodness the other one is fulham which has been promoted uh, Saturday, September 10th, 2022, and the return leg on Saturday 4th, February 2023. Tottenham Hotspur, we have them in the month of August. Goodness, goodness, this is a big one. Eh? Um, 13th of August, 2022, and the return match will be played on 25th of uh, February 2023. And then finally, uh, West Ham. Yes, West Ham United on Saturday, September 3rd, 2022. Uh, the return match will be played on 11th of Saturday, to, uh, on Saturday 2023. That will be in February. Jesus. That is, a, that is a big match. That is a big match. That is a big one. Uh, that is our, uh, our fixture briefly and also the derby briefly. We've had a lot. We've achieved a lot as Chelsea. Uh, it's a new it's a new season of course we expect not the same as last last season uh we ex we expect to at least sign some players so just stay tuned to know what uh we'll be talking about in our next in our next session in our next video of course we might be focusing on our transfers and our rumors that is rumors surrounding chelsea transfers uh, now we have a, a new a new owner the american we also uh, try and figure what he's up to and of course cover him so stay tuned uh, to our next videos otherwise thank you so much for watching uh, in details you can go to chelsea.com uh, and find out all about our fixture uh, for 2022 2023 remember to subscribe and comment thank you so much and uh, we love chelsea chelsea's ours and we will always remain uh, chelsea fans if you have not uh, purchased your ticket make sure you do so right signing out cheers